What is up guys, so you're here with the MXPR Gamer and I'm here to show you how to change a Steam skin because a lot of people ask that question and it re really looks kind of cool. So you want to open up your Steam and then after you want to open up your internet browser. I already have two skins in already installed in Steam but I'm just going to still show you how to you know, do it. So, Alright, so what you want to do is you want to open up Google Google Chrome or Firefox or Internet Explorer, which whatever you use to go on the internet, and then after just type in Steam skins, Steam custom skins, and then after this should pop up. It should say 12 best skins around. I'm gonna put this in a link b below, um, in the description, because um, you know, it'll be easier to go to. Alright, so over here they just have like 12 good Steam skins that you can um, view by pressing the preview button before you download it. So this one is um, the shiny one, I think. Yeah, simple red. Uh, this one is the Metro. This is the one I have downloaded. That downloaded. Pixel version, this is the one I had downloaded too. And they got some other stuff too, like inverted yeah so white uh original steam i don't know it looks kind of weird uh ice pig that's too bright green power it's too many colors but it still looks nice so blue pulse and yeah, looks kind of cool and uh alert skin Alright, so I'm gonna download the alert skin because I think the alert skin is kind of uh, cool. Alright, so you have to download the skin, so just download, press the download button. Then after it gives you this link, all add-ons will start popping up like this. So just, you know, just don't even mind it. Alright, and then after you just want to click download right here. Not all these download things down here. And stuff and if you want to you can leave a comment and everything saying like you know talking to the owner of the steam skin all right so you just want to double click on this also guys you're gonna need WinBra or 7-zip to get this you can either download the trial or buy it so yeah all right so just go over to alert skin just when you open up the skin thingy it should have a readme file in there if it doesn't just uh follow what i'm doing right here and you go to here let me show you, you go to steam and you go to settings and then after you want to go to interface so interface is down here above the downloads and below i mean above the downloads and below the in home streaming and you should see over here it says select the skin you wish to use on steam since I don't have it on, well, I didn't add it to Steam yet, I'll show you how to add it to Steam too. So, you're going to want to exit out of Steam because you're going to have to restart your Steam when you do this. And then after, you want to go into your folder where you installed Steam at. So, I'm going to go over to my hard drive and program files, Steam, and then after, it should say Steam steam skins like this skins and then after you want to do that it should have a I mean you should drag it to the side to the skins everything this is a skins uh, I read me file it's just gonna show you things I don't know what this is basically cuz I didn't read it but it's just like uh, I don't know oh this is just Telling you hit F key when running Steam clients. Okay. So then after you want to open back Steam, and then once you open Steam, you it won't automatically pop up, but you have to go to Steam settings interface and default skin. If you click it, it should be a skin like this, and then after it's gonna tell you restart your Steam. That's what I'm doing right now and just wait a couple of seconds so steam can start up uh, there we go so as you see there's a new skin right now connecting to steam account 
And this is really a easy uh, thing to do because a lot of people don't know how to put the skins on. So this is going to be a good tutorial for other people who don't know how to put skin, Steam skins on. And Steam skins make Steam look really cool and nice. So basically this is the alert skin. Uh, but I don't think it's that cool more than um, the Metro one. The Metro and the Pixel version because uh the the metro one is kind of nice but i like the pixel version better but the pixel version you can't barely see the text so that's why i like the um metro one better so just wait and finish it all right so basically that's about it right now so i'm just putting on my metro steam um skin okay there we go and this is how the metro steam skin looks and they got like a uh, shift tab when you shift tab it's also different too so I would recommend this one because this one looks really neat and nice and it looks organized but that's in your opinion so I hope you guys enjoyed the video I'll see you guys later in my next video stick out for more videos if you don't know how to do anything on steam check my profile I have steam how to's and uh, yeah that's about it so I'll see you guys later bye